Today is Throwback Thursday. Today, as much as we will not be going into history and stuff today, Throwback Thursday, I'll just tell you one or two things that you guys see on a daily basis and mm -hmm. you just don't know what they're used for or why they are there or mm -hmm. what's the purpose of this. So let's start with the scissors. No, let's start with a blonde scissors. You have a blonde scissors at home and you're wondering like, how can I use this thing? This thing is blunt. It's even dead, yeah? It's simple. You don't have to go to uh, get, get someone to file it. You don't have to get a file. Just mm -hmm. get your, uh, what's it called, foil paper. And just cut through it. It sharpens it immediately, like oh. razor sharp sharpening. Just cut through your foil paper with it. Pla, pla. Wow, let's see. And it will become extremely sharp. You can do the same thing with your knives. If you have a foil okay. paper at home, just try cutting through it a couple of times, and you have yourself a filed sharp. Are you serious? Knife. Yep. I have tons of scissors in my house. Just cut through. Just and, and tell me about this next time we we'll see. Cut through foil okay. paper with your scissors and mm -hmm. see how sharp, how razor sharp it becomes. What? <laughs> oh, yours is still sharp. Everything sharp. Uh, uh, okay. Sharp. Yeah. Sharp. Day. Like sharp. Day. Sharp. Day. Okay. Okay. So another thing is the another thing a lot of people wonder what's this thing for. They see it all the time. The padlocks. You, we all have. Yeah. Some people have padlocks in their house. You, yeah. Yeah. Even though the padlocks are gradually becoming extinct but mm -hmm. some people still use them the padlocks have been around for a while and there's this tiny hole underneath the padlock what do you think that hole is for we see it there all the time that Isn't one that where the key goes the, oh that's my the, the key is the one on deep the, that's the key that tiny small oh, the, the tiny hole by yeah, that one. Oh, i always I think uh I, I don't know i thought it was just there design. for design yeah why don't they just put a hole there for, for air to pass through so that hey. the thing will not get wow i never even noticed so that the padlock will suffocate <laughs> Wow, wow. Okay, so that, that part, but you see me now, you, you think, oh, yeah, I know. Uh, it's to prevent rust, so that whenever it rains or whatever it is, the water just, it goes in there and it just drips, it drains out of that particular tiny hole. Wow. Yep. It doesn't work that way. Uh -uh. It does work that way. So it so prevents rust I, a lot. I was almost there now. Eh. Well, it still has something to pass through. Yeah, it still get very rusty. So Then when the, the water is there, retained in that. There's no way tiny. out. No, what I'm That's saying is... Never mind, yeah, but... never mind. Okay. <laughs> anyway, uh, let, I'm going to take one for the last one. Let me take this one. The jeans pocket. The tiny, hole, the tiny pocket in your denims. Yes. That yeah. one. What do you think it's for? I have no idea. It's where it goes way back, way back in them days. Everyone like, thinks it's a fashion statement. Like, oh, it's yeah. just to make your... But no. Uh, in the 18th... I think in the 19th or 18th century, it was for pocket watches. In the in the olden days, like oh. you drop your pocket watch like that, you drop your pocket watch in there. That was the main reason for right. creating this small tiny pocket that you are seeing like this. You see, right? So it, it's not for fashion, or it's not to keep your sim or your ring or Actually, that's or, what I've been doing or your memory card. <laughs> it's just yeah, there you have it. Wow. And finally, your the, your brushing technique, the way you brush your mouth, you know, everybody will you know, talk, 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 just pour water. Yeah. But do you know that uh, medically, you are not supposed to rinse with water when you're done brushing? I do know that. Tell no, me about it, I don't. Know. You're not supposed to rinse with Even at the back of every pack, it's written there. Or you just check, you say, do not rinse, just spit out. And let the fluorides and everything, all the, let it work in your dentition, let it settle in. You don't just <laughs> and throw out, you don't do that. You just spit out and chill and let it just. So, after the, everything is dried up, you can now use your mouthwash a bit to just grab the hair there. So, but you don't rinse with water. water. Nah. Wow. You're welcome. Right. <laughs> <laughs> hey. I've never practiced it. Why do you think it's Like, it, do you understand? Know well, and then I don't rinse my mouth. Ah, sorry, Olu. Don't think that it's sticky. This is water to rinse. Please, I know what you're saying, but yeah. Yeah. You're supposed to be sticky, Jaren. Is it that created? Is it that created the something? Is it? Is it? Is it Oyembo? No, 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 no. The person that created, I say, this is what it is for. What is your own? You don't know under what condition that person was saying it to. Hello, come on. We're saying the same thing. Oyembo people, they are talk. That's their headache. Okay, cool. Are we ready to get straight to the business? All right. So, Nigerian a singer, songwriter, and performer, Divine Ikubo. Everybody knows him as Rema has broken a Billboard Hot 100 record that was set by Afrobeat superstar Whiskey Starboy's frontline act and owner Whiskey formerly held the record for the highest charting Nigerian song on the Billboard Hot 100 after his smash hit Essence. I didn't really have an essence, which featured East Nigerian songstress 
terms, and Canadian pop star Justin Bieber picked at number nine position on the chart. In an update of events, the official Billboard chart Twitter account announced on March 21st, 2023, that the 22 year old Rema had broken Whiskey's record in a chart dated for March 25th, 2023. The singer's global hit, Calm Down. I don't know how that song, why that song is not even calming down, mm -hmm. which features Selena Gomez, picked at number eight position, making it the highest charting Nigerian song on Billboard Hot 100 charts so far. Look, I am not a huge fan of Rema. Hmm. Honestly, I'm not. I know some people will come for me like, ah, I, 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 use it. I just feel that <laughs> it, it's, it's not, it doesn't work for me, right? But the fact that, that his songs and his music, people, I don't know, it's cross, cutting across the whole world and the world, it, Calm Down was re, uh, released when? See what yeah. it's doing on Spotify, on Billboard 100. <laughs> Nigerian music is not just Nigerian music anymore. anymore. It's a statement no, it's right not. now. It's what everybody is breathing. It's the air right now. Mm -hmm. It's the truth Globally. right now. Yes. What's your take on this? Ah, baby, calm down. Calm down. Yeah, no, 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 no. Anyways, I'm not a fan, though, but I, I oh, think yeah, I like you're that. You're also not a fan. Not your own type of, oh, not okay. a fan. Like, oh. I'm just there. Uh, I'm okay. And it's surprising, you know, Nigeria, the way we're taking, you know, sports right now, we're just there. We're just, like, in everybody's... Especially our entertainment. Our yes. entertainment scene. Music, to be precise. Yes. I think, I think the Nollywood is still coming and getting there, but music... They are gone. They are, they are, they are ahead. They are going. What? Even Nollywood, they are awake and they're trying to step up now. Yeah. Like, yeah, okay. actually. We're for music. Actually. Yes, so, it's so if you're doing, what's your, what's your take on this? Grandma? Uh, are you a fan? Not really. Oh, oh God. Grandma, sorry, yo. So it's not like that, though. But, you know, it's what it is. It is what it is. It I is what understand. it is. I mean, we don't know how these things work and we don't know how he is up there, dates and everything. So... We do know how it works. We, we, do know, we do know how it works yeah. for the next time because um, all the streaming platforms, it's how many times people are streaming this, how much yeah. people are streaming it. Yeah. Uh, recently, I think at, uh, what's, I think it was one football match, it was a super, not a Super Bowl, at an American football match and they, they, they played a song in the stadium and the whole stadium went ballistic. Mm -hmm. and, yeah. And majority of them were whites. I think mm -hmm. it was in Ireland or something. And everybody went ballistic. So it's it's not just streaming farms that people are just like, mm -hmm. the Bible it's organic. Says that a prophet is not recognized in his own home. Yeah. So if we are not here, mm. if we are not here, we are not really playing his music and everything. Now that, you know, Nigerian songs are going globally and everything, well, other people are. And well, I think the here, aspect you're coming from, anyway, it just works. I think oh, we're, we're playing. We're playing I don't know exactly. You know how they must have it. But she's right. It is over the Bible. Anyways, <laughs> let's move on to people who are not um, really being friends with each other. This is a, part of, a particular... Uh, reality show that I say all the time that I do not, I cannot stand. Big Brother Niger level up start doing, not your doing by the way, cause an online buzz after expressing her displeasure at Big Brother Niger Shine Your Eye winner, White Money. White Money uh, was embroiled in, in controversy after he shared a video of where he spoke on how no woman is out of a man's league. According to him, all the man needs to do is make money and he will, he will determine, determine the kind of game the lady will decide to play with him. White Money's video went viral and raised interesting reactions from netizens, including fellow Big Brother Ninja star Doni Davis. Doni made uh, her displeasure at White Money's statement known and added that it was sadly the kind of mentality men, men had. Now... Ladies, <sighs> shoot. I, th I think Doreen should go first on this one. Because it's Doreen, <laughs> like... Your name's Well, it. obviously, right. that mentality is very flawed. And Doreen is right. A lot of men have this mentality. And what's actually sad is a lot of women also have this mentality. Right. You know? And, and the saddest part is that how many women have even tried to prove this mentality wrong? Like, we can be out there in everybody's faces, like, saying, oh, my God, that's not true, blah, 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 blah. But what is happening? What is the reality of things? How many women are actually not materialistic people? And, no, everybody likes money. Plus men, plus women. No, everybody like likes... You don't like money. Are you serious? Yes, that's, that's, that's terrible. <laughs> anyway, everybody likes money. Nobody can say, oh, I don't like money and everything. But then we have people who are, like, who can sell their mothers for money. <laughs> you get we have those kind of people too and men just kind of play on these things i mean they have money and they, they hardly want to go with women that also have the, the, the their, their level of of money because then they have nothing else to offer they don't have any game when all you have is money you're in soup mm -hmm. 
it's a problem but some people don't know well what i don't like ah uh, what i don't like is the fact that you know the way they come for ladies i know that yes we have people like that but it's how they always come for ladies and just make it look like you can just do like this and then they will just appear you can just do like this and then they will just appear really it's tiring and uh, well i don't know if i can say this but i'm not a fan of white money i wasn't even happy that he won sorry but so him coming from that aspect and then even saying this i'm like what's wrong with this one? you say we we'll vote for you i mean we we'll vote for you so um i i i get what um doing is saying and she's actually right and just like what you said too you know there are ladies that act the way he's saying it mm -hmm. and then there are also ladies that don't do that i know some men that will say oh i like your i like your natural just because they don't want to give money or just because they feel there are people with that kind of without mentality makeup. i all like right. it without makeup all those things so right, please cool. they should stop Ecoucher. um okay so let's let's lay down right now what are the what are the basic things you're looking for in a relationship honestly just let's go bam 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 like three Hmm. Um, honesty is very important One. for me. Stability. So what, what, what do you mean by stability? Stability, like, um, I just, I need you to, I need to know where we are and what we're doing. I don't want it to be an up and down, off and down. That's stability. That's stability so for honesty, me. Stability. What you think I meant by stability is security. You were thinking about security. Honesty, so, stability. <laughs> and security. <laughs> What's security now? Security is, is financial security. And I'm going to say this. Right, I'm gonna say this. There is it. no, yeah, it's, there is a level at which a woman can be considered irresponsible. There's a level at which she gets to that she can be considered irresponsible if she dates a man below that status. Mm. Hmm. Like, I have struggled all my life, my father has struggled all his life to send me to make sure that I'm at this point, and then I go and decide I want to be with somebody that is below that status and that is not even trying. Mm. What's going to link us together? How do I meet this person in the first place? Ecoilink bridge. The place you find yourself. <laughs> so you're saying three. Um, for me. She said she said a three. Yeah. Don't be vexed. You are vexing already. I'm not vexing. Okay. Commitment. Like, Wait, commitment first. Yes, commitment. Right, Honesty. Honesty too. Yes. And uh, I don't I don't know. I yeah, transparency. Like I just want you to be you just that's honest, isn't it? Yeah, I know, but there's a way I don't I don't know how to really put it in words, but I think I know how I want it to just go and everything. I won't say you, money. You, you, you sound like a lady. Anyway, uh zero nine zero nine eight four zero eight four zero eight. Please get at us and let us know exactly what do women want. Is is white money right by saying this? Because I actually think like at the end of the day, what is a woman really looking for? Forget all this all this uh, campaign strategy when I was just talking about. Money is important. Yes. Financial stability is really, really yes. important. Are you going to say yes to me or anybody or any man and you find out that this guy is on zero level financial but, stability? But, Wait, oh, she's not talking about it. We cannot get there first without crossing the bridge first. See, where white money is coming from is not what you are saying. So don't try to do the same thing. You said. Don't use your phone to cover it. Calm down. Let me say it again. Now, he said, like, all a man needs to do mm -hmm. is, be, is be financially stable mm -hmm. and comfortable and can determine whatever game. Yeah, like, that no woman is out of your league. See, you can have all the money in the world. So I think what if he I'm said... If I'm not interested in you, mm. it's not about your money. If I'm not interested in you, then I'm not interested it's in you. It's It's not about the money. No, no, no. It is not about the money. It is about the money. It is about the money. You know, there are people that would approach you in their, in their millions, with wow. their cars and all the flashy things. And you still say no to them. So if it was about the money, I think you'd have said yes to would um, ladies would have said yes to almost all the guys that approach them. Anyways, that that uh -huh. way you're talking now. There's, there's somebody on our team, right? Mm -hmm. Her name is Coco, right? Yeah. There's this amazing guy that's on our case, David. I'm so sorry, but I have to put you on the blast. And David is very comfortable. He treats her like a queen. Does mm -hmm. everything for her, buys everything for her. But my dear sister Coco says David is short and is not fine. Oh my so God. she doesn't want. As in, he treats her. Extremely, so you're right. saying that he has the money, but he's not getting the girl. Yeah, he's not getting the girl. I'm just saying, I'm just, I just agreed what you said on that, but that doesn't that's mean the point. That's, 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 so it's not about the money, if it was money, I'm sure she would have said, You know what? See, it's not fine, he's short, but I can still go with the money. It is not, it doesn't stop there. Serious pet peeves. See, no matter how fine you are, or the amount of money you have, mm. that if you have these issues. I cannot stay without you because all I'll be thinking about is different ways to kill you. 
Ah, uh, don't know this girl. Yes. Be with you. I will kill you, and I will cry the most, and I'll still inherit all your money. Okay, we don't we don't support so, violence. Here. We yeah, don't, no violence. Don't That's <laughs> I'm not deal. I don't no. No. Anyways, uh, for every man out there, um, ignore what they said. Hustle, make your money. Right, approach the right person. Talk. Forget this. No, uh, go and have money. You. Of course, go and have money. money. Don't no, come and sit down and be looking at you. We should fight. No, I, 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 no I, I, go I, and I have money. Don't come and sit down and be looking at me. I'm telling you, I like your natural hair. <laughs> I like it without makeup and all those things. Go and make your money. Do you understand? Of but then, money. you cannot say it's because of the money. That is why no, I'm coming like from. This is what I'm saying. You, you cannot like it. You must like my bullshit. You must be <laughs> straight. <laughs> what do you mean? This is what I mean when I say that there's a level you get to as a woman that makes you irresponsible if you decide to date like you know a lower status quo man. Because see, I can do um, things for myself. Why am I going to carry Mouse, this Please, 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 let me just drop this in. See, drop it like it's hot. Okay, so a relationship I'm aware of, right? You know, they started a relationship, the guy wasn't all there and right, everything, right, right. and they were managing and stuff like right. that. And then in between, the guy would have money today, you know, the thing would just be going up and down, up and down like that, and everything, right. And then now she needs certain kind of things that she's expecting from but as a boyfriend, you support her, right? right and all those things, right? So it's kind of affecting the relationship so what i'm trying to say by bringing this is the fact that it's not always almost about the money but then again the money is it's still important. needed in the relationship so but she cannot say and um, because he has money and everything let me follow him no please okay please uh simi has something to say to everyone who's um, going through old age and brokenness it's called ageism uh, ageism she's she's <laughs> uh, she's become she has become an advocate for you people she's yeah. saying that to me hey. your opinion that this is someone <laughs> with their age or being broke is silly and shows lack of creative ways to put people in their place i have a question when you said you people eh? she has something to say she's defending you people what did you mean by that who is you people mm. the broke people and why are you referring to us you went like for you people you people talk. <laughs> See, you people talk. Ah, I'm going to tear you up. <laughs> anyway, so, um, well, I think I, 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 I get what she's saying. Because you can't, um, if I understand what she's saying, you can't, what's the code now? Being aged and then being broke at the same time. Yes, yeah, that that's what she's. That's not what she said. Okay. What, she, what she was saying was this, right? If you're gonna um, insult someone, maybe you're having a fight with someone. Yeah. It, this the person directly. Don't say, "Oh, look at you." So someone, you someone have... yesterday told me said, uh, one of my colleagues yesterday, she said, "I think it's precious here." Yeah. Person, oh my God, Miles, you having? Was it gray precious? hair? You having gray hair? I'm like, yeah, you will get there. It's oh, no, it was cookie. Like, oh, yeah, don't worry, you will get there. Mm -hmm. it's, it's a thing that happens to everyone, and it's a beautiful <laughs> thing when you age, age gracefully, and own it it's nothing wrong with it mm. but people are gonna you this old woman go and sit down you this old man go and sit down or especially women when a woman wants to diss a man the the fastest or easiest thing they, they get to say is yeah uh, you're broke if you see broke guy the same way when a man goes to diss a woman the first thing he goes is you this a shower a shower and broke no 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 uh, because you're blessed to have one or two things at social point right now doesn't mean it's not gonna happen for every other person right mm -hmm. um, I, I, I in, in the place of work in our place of work yeah. I've heard of situations where somebody was telling say, saying that all oh, people are not up to their level I'm like okay because it has happened to you now because God has given you that tick doesn't mean every other person is not going to get there at some point. And mm -hmm. it's a gradual process. So that's what you're saying. Like, yeah, it's don't broke shame people. If yeah. can, and even when you have the money, now, get time before any property. Yes, yes, If you yes. have the money, when anything goes around and comes down, you just, you just become somebody I don't want to mention. Yeah, you don't rub right. it on people's face. And people are quick to oh. age shame people. That thing is um, annoying. It's we, a stigma. It's beco it has become a stigma. That's why you see people deducting from their age. They are 20, they are 25 every year. <laughs> Especially, especially our actresses. Yep. That thing, no, that thing irks me. Like, wh why are you lying about your age? And no, I get what you you mean because society has made it seem like you are not supposed to be aging. You're, you're like you're supposed to stay on a particular age to be trendy or something, and yeah. it's just weird. So what Simi is saying is that if you want to come for somebody, you want to come say something. Directly. You understand? Don't go through the corners. Yeah. Like, and she also said something that's 
got to me about how you should have more constructive ways if you want to just call somebody else then have more constructive ways of doing it mm -hmm. it it speaks to your own lack of um intelligence if you're trying to insult somebody or Based talk on down on them things. and you're mm -hmm. using like the, the fact that they don't have their old or or they don't have money yeah if you don't get to that age it's because you're dead bro you because you what? Because it you're did. dead. That's what she actually meant. Yeah, yeah. that's what she said. Yeah, yeah. So, I, I, I age is a beautiful thing. I just stay away from it. I just stay away from it. Age is a beautiful thing. And Grace said, do not, you can't even run it. I was going to say, do not run away from it. You can't even run away from it. It's something that's going to be there. Yeah. Do you understand? Like, now, people like, oh God, I don't the age. I don't talk my age. I don't like that in it. I don't like people that try to shy away from their age and then we also have people too that you know reduce their age i know someone that she's always acting like her age mate and then you will now let her see another thing that's football age that's not that's 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 <laughs> and it's not hollywood age and it's not hollywood age yeah right like yeah, all my, sure you yeah. know passport age yes, pass, too. that's what i was going <laughs> like on my am i supposed to, say, no. go to jail no, no. Mm -hmm. on my international passport right yeah. i'm like i'm like two years younger in real life Okay. You understand? That's like football age for a part yeah, right? So I'm just saying. Do you age? The only time you hear me talk about age is when I'm arguing with someone, and I'm like, I'm not your mates. Mm -mm. Don't don't so talk now, to now. me like that. Like nah, I'm not having it. Mm -mm. I am not your mate. My younger sister is not. But let's even talk mate. about. Let's even talk about yeah, that. Do you know do that, that thing can actually be really annoying? I when don't actually it, do that. No, I, I do that, that because, because I'm like, like man. Like, uh -uh. Like, are you, are you well? No, like, why are you saying this? I'm you, if not and for condition or something. Way, why you, why you disrespect me? I know. Like, so it I, really gets on my nerves. I will like, say I, that. Even me, my I younger know. one is way older than you are. So she gets. Well, because we are, we are shining seats. Nah, I will always I, point out that one. I, I, I know I always do that. I a reciprocal person. So maybe because I'm not usually in that position. I don't know. I know. I put that out there. Let's take one more story. Then we just go listen to some throwback songs real quick. And this one is from, this one is someone who didn't get a lot of, she got a lot of bad boots for this thing she, she put on right okay. now. Uh, media put personality, it's okay, Martin, well, she's always in the news for something. She had stunning photos of herself on Instagram and wrote on her story, don't, ju uh, don't just admire the beauty, send funds. Now, okay, yeah, snap your finger. Now, while some people were like, mm -mm, hot girl, blah, 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 some, some other people just went ballistic and like, oh, God, Later, you people say, oh, they're sexualizing women, they're objectifying women, like, okay, send funds because we are sending funds to you because you are beautiful. And I really, really tap into that. Like, okay, so we should send funds to you because, what, you, you, you're a fine girl. So if a man now comes now and tells you, like, okay, I'm, I have money, I'm all that. I have money, I have, I have all that. Oh, yeah, it's okay, man. Okay, cool. So what's up? Take money. Let's, let's be, you, you can't come and start crying wolf. Yeah, do you imagine one man just spoke? Spoke. Thank you. Um, we have we also have like birthday people that will just be like, don't just say happy birthday, send funds. Well, no, 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 I'm, I'm getting no, no, somewhere. I'm, I'm going somewhere. You know, I remember there was this year that the video did his own and everybody do, 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 do. they sent money like my people that don't have money in their own accounts. They sent money. No, no, to no, no he didn't do his own. No, no, don't do that. Baby, no. don't, baby, no. Okay. They did not. Post a picture and say, oh, don't no, no, no. Right. No, no, no. Don't, 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 even, don't even compare. No, no, no. It wasn't a picture that he posted. Okay. I think it was, I think, yeah, yeah, based on the false things, what I'm trying to talk about. So, the fact that people are um, uh, making it about, or because of this this particular situation where she posted her picture, or whatever, people are focusing on the whole the beauty. Like Do you get it? Maybe they just don't like her. Maybe she's just for something. She's always like, because it's a, it's, I, I, it was even in, in jokes, like you that you are fighting and you are doing foo foo foo. That they you you are justifying did 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 did. She will feed you for like five months straight. You don't have the funds you want to send to her. So why are you angry? Twitter warriors. Me, I don't I don't say anything wrong with what she said. Yeah. yeah, I don't. If if you if you like how she's taking care of herself, support so join <laughs> the ministry and be go straight in and be buying the you know. See, you know, the thing is, she might have tons of bone straights and everything, but you could just still give that. She'll still collect it. I'm just sorry, I don't know. I got my no, 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 please, please wait. Not ever yeah, if you give me, I'll collect it. But eh, what I'm saying, I'm just using that as an example now. Mm -hmm. But what I'm saying is, I agree with what she's saying. If you that's like what I said, I like your natural hair just to avoid that you don't want to buy this. Thing. I, I, I like, I like this your blue bag with your green slippers. And oh, thank you. <laughs> okay. Let's go.